Hi, so today I'm going to be showing you how to disconnect your Skype account from your Facebook uh, login. Uh, one issue that a lot of people have is when Skype logs in via Facebook, uh, they have access to all of your messages and your chats and that kind of thing, and it shows you as available within chat every time you log into Skype. Uh, so what we're going to do is disconnect Skype from Facebook. And the first thing we're going to do is just open up Skype so I can show you uh, what happens when you first log in. Alright, so now when you first log in, it's going to be presenting these uh, different um, Facebook permission dialog boxes. Um, so you're going to need to give it permission to access your newsfeed. Um, and then it's going to ask for permission to post uh, to your friends on your behalf. And you can actually change this to only me. Uh, that's what I do every time there's any kind of uh, login or anything like that. Um, so hit OK. Um, and now the final dialog box is going to say Skype would like to manage your messages. Um, so if you click skip, it, it will still log you into Skype, but it will prevent it from accessing your Facebook messages. So you can see here uh, that I'm not logged into Facebook now. Um, if for some reason you've already logged into Skype and now you need to remove access, uh, what you're going to do is go to facebook.com slash settings, and then you're going to go to the applications tab. Uh, so it looks like app settings like this. Um, click on apps over here on the left. Um, and if you scroll down to Skype and then you click on edit, you'll see all of the different permissions that you've given this application. Um, now I just clicked skip on that previous dialog box, so there's not an entry here for allowing access to your messages. But if you've previously logged in with Facebook, it will have access to your messages and it'll show up right here. So what you can do is just click the little X and it will remove the permissions from Skype. Now, every time you log in from here on out in the future, it's going to re-ask you for that permission, and you have to make sure that you click skip, like I showed you before. Um, so that's everything. Uh, once you do that, you can log out of Facebook chat, and when you log into Skype, you're not going to be having uh, any more um, logins via Facebook, so people won't be able to see that you're logged into Facebook. So if you have any questions, leave a comment, and I'll try to help you out. Thanks for watching.